Hello everyone, everyone. So I'm here for Basketball Wives LA Season 6 Episode 5. Now before we get into this review, give us a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and make sure your notifications are on. Now y'all, y'all know Jackie, she's still in her feelings that she was not at the meeting where Tammy and Evelyn had their kumbaya moment. So she didn't ask Shana to set up this meeting. But since she's known, she knows that Tammy and Evelyn been known to throw bottles at people or grab what is the closest, you know, item to them where they can swing on somebody. She asking these people at this restaurant, um, can you get rid of these glasses and bring some plastic cups? I know y'all are a fancy establishment, but we need some plastic cups here. She get to hide in the knife. She got her ponytail in her jacket because she's ready to fight. Soon, I'm telling you, she gets there. And when she sees that Evelyn and Tammy have walked in together, now she's already on 10. Like, I can't believe it. These two is friends again. They friends. Now I feel left out because I wasn't there to mend the friendship. And I'm telling you, they hadn't even sat down good. And her first words was, let's fight. Which made Tammy and Evelyn and Shawnee just bust out laughing like, what? Now we know your crazy meter be just going off at random times. But your first word to me is, let's fight. Do you really want this from me? You know I be blowing, throwing them bows. Do you really want this? I know you got that you know, crazy fighting you. But I got the fighting fighting to me. And I will hurt you. Child, she gets to sitting there and talking. It was like, first of all, my thing is, why is, is, is Jackie mad that they're friends again or is she mad she wasn't there to facilitate their friendship because she's like well i want to make you guys i want you guys to come together and help you guys get back was it, is that the reason she's mad that she wasn't one to bring their friendship back together and she get to talking acting stupid and they saying no she gra gra grabs a dominatrix looking muzzle out of her purse and i'm like jackie we didn't have this conversation about you and Doug's sex life I don't need you to be bringing the toys that y'all use together for the world to see. Because she didn't put this muzzle on. Like, I'm going to put this muzzle on and I'm going to just shut up. Because y'all laughing at me. And now my feelings are hurt. I'm like, Jackie, we can't keep going through this cre crazy that we have with you. I'm going to need you to keep it calm and level. Because they just sitting there laughing like, girl, what is wrong with you? The reason why you weren't brought there because your, your drama... Added on to our drama. And we need to figure out our drama first before we got to your drama. Like you showing up to my book signing unannounced and uninvited. She's like, well, I know I was uninvited, but I figured since we was friends, I should come. Even though I was uninvited. And I'm like, Jackie, you came there to start something in that red coat looking like where in the world is Carmen San Diego about here? So since Tammy and Shawnee are lazy people, her words, not mine, they go to some like body sculpting place to where I guess it's supposed to like, it's not lipo, but it's supposed to get rid of the fat that you have on your body. And the only problem with this is they get back here and the place seems like it's a place where you get your lashes done. This not this does not seem like a place where you should be getting some kind of any kind of body sculpting done. And then body sculpting done. And then Shana's like, well, I don't I have never been here, but I heard about this place on Instagram. You heard this on Instagram and you thought it was a good idea to take you and your friends here to see what was going on. Really? We doing it. You've never been here. You never tried it out. You never heard somebody actual in your faith that you know tell you that this was a good place to go. So they was like, well, we don't know what's going on. We need to slip out and slip out now. We're going to say we got some interdiction problems going on. Got to upset stomach. Y'all got to drive me home because we need to get out of here because ain't nobody came back here yet. This place looks like you should be getting your eyelashes and your eyebrows done. Deuces, we out. So later on, they didn't met up having drinks. They didn't invite Jackie and Jackie again. She's on this, well, I feel lonely. Malaysia, she's moving to Atlanta. And I said, I want to go because she's the closest person I have to me. And you guys known each other for years, but I'm not really close. Like I put stuff on Instagram and you don't like it, but everything you put on Instagram, I like it. I'm like, Jackie, can we not? Jackie, I, she can find any situation and make it about her. So they sitting there talking and Evelyn, she didn't got in her mind. I want to give 
Kristen, Kristen a makeover. The girl always looking like first one thinking another. Her words, well, I'm paraphrasing. Like, you you got on biker shorts. You a pretty girl, but you just don't know how to dress for your body. So, who shall they see? A celebrity stylist over there. So, they usher her over and she gets into her confession. And like, I'm like, is this y'all way of bringing in somebody else that is coming to basketball wives? I was like, why does she really need a confession unless she's going to be on the show? But I was like, okay. She comes over to her. She gets to name drop on who she's worked for. She wants to know, hey, this person you want me to style, is it head to toe type of thing? Do I need to do hair? Is it a whole demolition type of situation? Just a few pieces? Just let me know. And next thing you know, they like hand her a, gla um, a drink. And then Evelyn and Jackie like take turns just feeling on this girl's breasts. I'm like, when do we just start feeling on strangers' breasts? Just because you think they look good. Can somebody please tell me this? Like, this girl, y'all don't know her from Adam, but y'all feel that y'all was comfortable enough to feel on her breasts? I'm like, I know Jack and this is Jack is saying all day, every day, but y'all just feeling on this random girl's breasts? Really? So, what else happened? Oh, Brandy, she's back in town, but she doesn't want anybody to know she's back in town. You can tell Jackie, but telling Jackie is like telling everybody. So, I guess everybody's going to know that she's back in town. So, that was just one on. If I left anything out, by all means, leave a comment or read a response. And like always, I thank my subscribers and the people who watch my videos. I want you to like this video, comment, and subscribe. And share this video with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and here on YouTube. This is Lady T signing off. Have a good one.